Well, it took a few months, but it looks like summer weather has finally arrived in Thunder Bay. With some thermometers hitting the 30 degrees again today, people across the city were looking for ways to beat the summer heat. Tara Allaire reports. Don Alford is visiting the city for eight days and said he couldn't have picked a better week to visit his granddaughter. He says they found a lot of fun ways to stay cool. Go out here in the park. We were here yesterday again because of the hot weather and it gives them a chance to cool a little bit. And uh, we go to the lakefront. We'll be there and your ice cream places, you know. We, and, well, we do the movies tomorrow. Uh, well, yeah, tomorrow. Tomorrow we do the movies. So they're going to need the smurfs or whatever it is. Yeah, so that's it. So you can do lots of things in Thunder Bay if you want. Kekabeka Falls, of course, is on the road, and that's always an attraction, a sleeping giant. Travis Varga went to Boulevard Lake with some friends to make the best of the late summer. He hopes a few more weeks of warm weather will let him add some hiking and camping to his list of activities. A couple of our friends, uh, we decided to come on down here to Boulevard, seeing how it's so extremely hot out, and we're going to toss this frisbee, go catch our swim going, you know, try to get a little exhilarated, refreshed, and, uh, yeah, you know, try to get a little bit of fun in it, too, so it's not too bad. I'm happy it's finally here. It's better than having those cool dark days with rain and all that thunder and that, and I don't know, I'm enjoying it. Over at Prince Arthur's Landing, the splash pad has been packed with families enjoying the sunny weather. Tina and Aiden Mines have been putting their air conditioning to good use, but decided the weather was just too nice to stay indoors this week. It's nice. We've actually got this week off, and usually by the end of the month, it's kind of cool out, and we don't really, can't really do much outside or camping and stuff, but it's kind of nice this year that we finally have our summer. And we can enjoy this last week off. Probably we're going to go out to camp and just go swimming and on the boat and stuff and just try and keep cool in the water. And it looks like the warm weather does not plan on going away. Despite a bit of rain and humidity, it should remain above 20 degrees for the rest of the week. In even more good news, officials at Thunder Bay Regional say despite the heat wave, the emergency department has not seen an increase in cases of heat stroke. Tara Allaire, TBT News.